is up, Fox? It is I, Jet, and I'm here to say hi to you. Um, this is just an update to say hi. Um, I've been doing physical therapy lately, and it is so freaking annoying. Um, they want to replace another uh, disc. So instead of just letting them replace another disc, they want me to try physical therapy first. Want to talk about unnecessary pain. It is the most annoying thing ever. Mm. Mm -mm. I tell you what, so unnecessary. They have me doing stretches and all this other stuff for no reason. They act like it's a muscle problem and it's not. It is literally <laughs> my <laughs> nerves in my spine are being crushed. <laughs> by narrowing and they are just having me stretch like that's going to fix anything Ugh. there are no words there are absolutely no words when did insurance companies become doctors again mm. no words absolutely no words Mm, no words. It's nonsense. It's the most pointless pain ever to put someone through. Like, the weight loss, don't mind. Don't mind. It's completely, that's necessary. That is absolutely necessary. Especially if you want to have surgery, it makes it so much easier. I have no problem with it. Seriously. But, oh my god. Physical therapy does nothing for what's wrong with me. I don't understand. Can anyone tell me why that would be necessary. Even the surgeon doesn't understand why they suggested to try that. He's like, that is not even necessary, but that's what we have to do before they'll let, they'll let me have the surgery. Because otherwise they won't pay for it. <laughs> Really? Tell me why that is even a thought. Can anyone tell me? Because I sure don't know. <laughs> I almost broke down in tears today doing this, these stupid exercises. Some of them weren't so bad because they're not on the side that's the worst, that has the worst pain. So like, they weren't so bad to do, but some of them were the most excruciating. I don't understand. I just don't understand. I guess that's what most of my problem is. <laughs> if they've told, if a doctor tells an insurance company, yeah, she needs to have surgery, and they're like, no, just put her through torture. That's all. <laughs> it just doesn't make sense. It just doesn't. I don't know. 
It just doesn't add to I'm really sure. I don't get it. At least the good news of my day was that uh, me and my son play this game, uh, Seven Days to Die. It's a zombie game. And I finally got enough resources together to get him a bike in the game. <laughs> so now he can ride a bike in the game to get away from zombies. So at least that happened today. That was good. I'm angry. I'm super angry. And, like, can anyone tell me? Seriously? Anyone that watches me with a pain disorder? With a chronic pain disorder or any anything with, with chronic pain? Why um, do people, when you tell them that you have chronic pain, why do they immediately point out that you have tons of piercings or tattoos? Why is that a thing? Why? Why do they immediately go to... Oh, but you'll let people put holes all over you and then give you tattoos and stick needles in you, but... Oh, this hurts? Yeah, asshole, that hurts. Congratulations, you've... You've figured it out. What? Why? That pain is momentary. Some of them didn't even hurt. Those are not constant. The pain right now is constant. Why do you bring that up every time I talk about chronic pain? I mean, every single time it's like a person with chronic pain can't have tattoos or piercings because it gets brought up all the time. I have three tattoos and a shitload of piercings and every time I tell someone I have chronic pain, they're just like, oh, but you'll have holes put all over you and you have tattoos everywhere. Yes, asshole, I do. What's your point? Yeah. What's your point? Do you want a cookie? You noticed. I don't, I... Most of the shit I got before I had my pain disorder. What's your point? Like, I don't, they bring it up every time. I don't know, I, that's, that's just another thing it's thrown in my face every time. It's so annoying. It's like if you have a chronic pain disorder, you can't have tattoos or piercings. Because you're painful. You're painful and you're sensitive. It's like, wow. I didn't know I had tattoos and piercings. Must have something to do with my pain. You're right. The pain's my fault because I have tattoos and piercings. That's got to be what it is. I didn't even connect that. My bad. <laughs> Maybe if I take it out and then get the tattoos removed, I'll be perfectly fine. <laughs> uh, 
I never thought about that. What was I thinking? Why are you bringing it up? Uh, I have to get physical therapy twice a week. So, basically, I have to get tortured twice a week for six weeks. And then I go back to see my surgeon so he can tell them it's not working. He's just hoping that I don't get hurt too much. And I was like, that's, that's really sweet. Appreciate that. It's wonderful. Uh, I'm going to hope that that happens too. It'll be nice. This is insane. This is insanity. <laughs> Can someone stop the ride? I want to get off. For real. I really want to get off. This is so stupid. Oh, I just thought I would complain. It sounded like fun. Thought I would share. I will talk to you guys later. Seriously. Someone stop the ride. I really want to get off this this crazy train. <sighs> Pray for me that I don't get hurt. And don't worry, I will take my piercings out and I will get rid of my tattoos because obviously that's where chronic pain comes from. I should have thought about that. <laughs> what was I thinking? Oh my god. I'll talk to you guys later. Deuces.